Hello my crafting friends. I'm coming with another card for a Use Your Stamps Monday and the card you're looking at, um, I had been gifted this really fun jar and I believe it's a Sizzix die and it comes with an embossing folder because I have this um, exact same die and kind of my thing um, coming up I need to start using my dies and you know die cutting some papers and just putting more of my dies to use but this came from Tina Kappa she had gifted me in a rack some beautiful um, trims wrapped around this card and I took all the trims and I made a bunch of lace flowers which um, I have on my Facebook page I have some for sale and I'm, I have a bunch made up I can put um, together as well but I'm kind of holding off because um, I haven't sold any of the ones that I had already put on my Facebook page so just a reminder to go over to that Facebook page and um, check out the items that I have for sale I'm going to be listening um, hopefully today um, I'll do a video I need to list some paper pads I'm de-stashing and some stamp sets so take a look at that. Um, I'll try to make videos when I update my um, page as to what's for sale. But I was a Stamps of Life member a long time ago when um, Stephanie Bernard first came out with the Stamps of Life. So way, way back. A um, long time ago. And um, then I just didn't really like, she's more um, what I would call like the whimsical stamps. And I'm not as much into um, the whimsical stamps. I like the sentiments and stuff. And I kind of like what I'm seeing. Tina Kappa gets their um, card kit. And I like it because it, she puts more stamp sets in there that are just like words um, and sentiments. And then usually a word die. So I don't know. Right now I'm doing the um, Stampin' Up! Paper Pumpkin. So I think that's you know good enough because I need to use what I have but I love this little jar and I added the Stamps of Life little owl I just um, stamped it a couple of times some chalk ink and then some Stampin' Up! ink and then this is a wood veneer um, that I was um, gifted and it just says thank you so much and then I just used some I believe this one is the Aged Rose um, stamp this frontage I got um, quite a bit of different colors of the frontage on Amazon because you can get the bigger jars and they have lots of colors out there. They're amazing versus just the little um, the kits like you can get at Joann's. So um, I have lots of different colors of it because I love what it does to the wood and um, metal pieces. So thank you Kim and Steph for a super fun challenge and I hope this inspires you gals to get those stamps out and put them to use and um, create some cards to have in a card stash or the holidays are coming up and a lot of people do craft fairs and bazaars. So thank you ladies for watching and happy crafting.